to scare you and say, well, you're going to die, you're going to do this, you're going to do that, if you don't listen to the Lord, blah, blah, blah. You know, they lead with that, but God led with the blessing. He said, if you do this and that, then I will bless you. So good, bless you in abundance. Bless you and bless you and bless you some more. If you listen to me and you are faithful, I will give it to you. It's like getting good grades and getting paid at the same time. That's a double blessing, right? Amen to that. Let's stop being for that. All right. You ever had somebody give you five dollars an A when you was a kid? Three dollars in B. You know, five tickets for skating. It's like, wait a minute. I was supposed to get good grades anyway. I was supposed to do good in school anyway, and you gonna pay me on top of it? I'm supposed to listen to God. He's my creator. He made me. How am I going to stray? That's like uh, Mattel making a toy and saying, you know what? You, you know, you do whatever you want to do. And that toy's like, I don't want to be with Mattel. I don't have to listen to what you said and my specs are. No. You got to listen. That's your maker. That he is our maker. So what I'm trying to say is that God made us. So it's only fair to say, you know what? I give my life to you. But God says, if you do what I say, you're supposed to do it anyway, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bless you on top of that. I'm going to bless you on top of that. So you don't have to worry about what the devil's trying to offer. That's, you know, you ever say that you get an email and they're like, win $1,000 gift card from Target. Whoever got a gift card? I didn't get a gift card. It had a small print. You must, you know, whatever, whatever. And it's so difficult to do. And it's, you have to claim it, and you might have to win it. And you get a one in a million chance to win that one little gift card. Really? No way time for that. It's a waste of time. That's how the devil is. Trying to trick you and, and trip you up, making you believe that you're going to come up, but you're not. You're really coming down. You're really going backwards instead of moving forwards. Because now God got to undo all of that. That's more time for you to, you could have got your blessing. That's more time that you wasted. That's more time that you gave up. That's more opportunity that you lost because you didn't want to fully obey. It's not even that hard. Loving people, forgiving people. I mean, this, it hurts when somebody does you wrong and you got to forgive them on top of that. Yeah, it does. But you know what? You'll be so bitter if you don't forgive them. You're doing yourself a favor. You know, you got to listen to the word. Get under that word and hear it every week. You, you may not know everything, but if you keep on sitting in the presence of God, you will learn what you need to know to move you forward. Amen? So God has given us a chance to receive blessings, incentives, bonuses, surprises. He has all of that for us. But you already got it once you obey. You already got it once you have the faith. So you can't, nobody can take it away from you once you have it. You know? You can't, you know, you can't, you can be fake for so long and then the truth is going to come out. You can act like you're obeying for so long and then the truth is going to come out. But what I'm saying to you now is your blessings are ordered and they're waiting to be delivered if you fully obey the Lord and you do all his commands and you're faithful and you have faith. Amen? Amen. All right, God bless you. Thank you.